uh, we are doing a product review on one of my items from my Ipsy bag this month. Um, I decided to go ahead and review the Golden Hours eyeshadow palette. Um, this is by Beauty For Real. It's a mango butter eyeshadow palette. Um, I have played with this a few times this week and I absolutely love it. It's got a nice little mirror on the inside. And these are the colors. This is what the palette looks like. Um, you can see where I've dipped into the gold there and I've used this blue and I really like this uh, pink color and this one makes a good inner corner highlight and you can tell I've also dipped into that one. Um, one thing I will say about this palette is that it is very powdery. You'll want to do it before you do your face makeup and I don't usually like to do my eyeshadow before my face makeup but you know sometimes you got to depending on the formula of the eyeshadow and this is definitely one that needs to be done before you do your eye makeup so uh, let's see what look we come up with today um, I am purely doing this for video purposes I it is like 8 30 at night I'm not going anywhere I'm basically going to do this and then take a shower and wash it all off so you know that's life sometimes I wanted to film this earlier today but I had a lot going on I had to do laundry um, for kids so yeah life is busy um, so I didn't get to it earlier but let's go ahead and just jump right on into it um, so let's take my glasses off and I'm going to grab a fluffy blending brush um, this is just one I got for Christmas one year it says Emacs designs it doesn't tell me what kind of brush like what the size is or anything so we're just gonna start I'm going to go in with this uh, lighter color here and I'm thinking so here's what I'm thinking I think we're gonna do this color and then we'll deepen it with this orange color and we'll deepen the outer V with this brown and then I'm going to do blue and pink and I kind of think in a halo I'm going to attempt a halo eye I'm not the best at that but we'll try it maybe who knows I might change my mind by the time we get into it so this color is called horizon and I'm just going to get my brush in there and I mean see what I mean it's I don't know if you could, the camera will pick up on it but it's very powdery so um, tap it and instead of using the viewfinder like I have a bad habit of doing I'm just going to use a mirror okay sorry if I completely block you out not my intentions okay go back in I don't like dusty eyeshadow palettes so I always blow it off after I dip my brush in and then again I just going in the crease with that let me zoom you in a little bit well that's not creepy at all okay not used to doing these makeup videos but I figured why not so I don't know you can see that in the crease okay so now we are going to go in with this orange color and again it is a very dusty like it went into the blue I don't know if you you can kind of see it on the camera there um, definitely went into the blue I'm gonna tap off the excess and you know what actually I changed my mind we are going in with a slightly smaller fluffy brush. Um, slightly smaller fluffy brush. Uh, focus. Okay, so it's not wanting to focus, but this is a brush by, by Glamour Dolls. Um, it does not tell me what brush it is, so. Um, gonna go into the orange and this I'm just gonna 
deepen my crease with. Okay. It's kind of like this like burnt orange color and it just deepens it up, adds a little bit of depth. And I really like it. Okay. And now I'm going in with this brown color and this I'm gonna focus in the outer corner here just to add a little bit more depth and that's what we've got so far so I'm gonna do the same on the other eye Folk, again, just folk, kind of focusing it on the outer corner, but bringing it in to the crease a little bit. And my camera battery might die, so let's just, let's be quick here. This is real life. Um, so no halo eye tonight because of my battery. I'm going to go in with this beautiful blue color. I've just got a flat shader brush. And again... gonna go in with that and then I'm gonna do the same on the other side oop I just dropped a chunk of eyeshadow that's what that blue looks like the camera is not really picking up on how pretty the color actually is which is unfortunate but what can you do okay and now I'm gonna just go in with my finger because shimmers always apply so much better with my finger and then okay now I'm going to take the other side of this uh, shader brush and I'm going to and I went into this pink sans color it's a I think it's dual chrome and it's beautiful so I'm just going to put some of that in there do the same on the other side. Oh, got too much of the blue. There we go. Okay, and again, I'm going in with my finger just to really make that color pop. And then I'm going to take my other finger that had the blue and go over where it meets so it kind of blends together and this is what we've got um, the camera's really not picking up on how bright and vibrant these colors are because they really are very vibrant colors okay so I am going to do the rest see how there's like the fallout there um, that's what I'm talking about like it's all under my eyes and like it came into the inner corner here so I'm gonna go ahead and charge my battery for a few minutes and do the rest of my complexion products and um, and then I'll be right back to show you the finished look so I will see you back here in a it'll be a second for you but it'll be a few minutes for me okay bye And we're back so this is the finished look um, I didn't do eyeliner or anything tonight just cuz you know I'm not going anywhere I'm not doing anything this is all just gonna get washed right off um, so no eyeliner tonight um, I do have this ill maquillage eyeliner that I want to review on here as well. This also came in my July 2021 Ipsy bag. For those of you who do not know, sorry, I dropped the palette. <laughs> uh, for those of you who don't know, Ipsy is a monthly beauty subscription that um, they've got three different levels. The first one is $12 a month and you get five sample size, sometimes full size items. Um, the, the, $25 a month bag, which is the one I do, uh, you get five 
full-size items, which is so very fun. That's a, that is, again, where this came from. Um, I wasn't super excited about the nude, uh, the neutrals in this palette. I'm just, I like bold, bright colors. Um, in an eyeshadow palette, so I wasn't super excited that this was mostly neutrals, but That pop of blue really pulled me in and that is why I chose this palette um, with the ipsy you can with the $12 a month bag you get One choice item the $25 a month bag you get Three choice items and this was one of my choice items. I am super happy with it. I really glad I chose it um it is a little powdery for my liking. I don't like powdery palettes. However, the color payoff is great. The color story is great. Um, it is a really good palette and I like it a lot. Um, I, it's just one that I have to do before I do my foundation, um, which kind of sucks. I don't like doing it that way, but you know, you do what you gotta do. And I just realized Sorry, there's kids in the background who are supposed to be in bed, but clearly they're not. Um, it's real life over here, people. But um, I f was telling you that there were three levels of Zip Ipsy, and I told you the first two, but I left out the third level. It is actually an upgrade to the Plus ba uh, bag. It's an extra $30 a month a quarter, so every three months you won't get your ipsy plus you'll get the ipsy glam bag x instead i do not subscribe to the x i believe that one comes with like eight to twelve full size items with some samples mixed in there i'm not sure don't quote me on that um if you've been curious and wanting to try ipsy out and wanting to get items like this palette um i am overall pleased with the palette like i said not thrilled about how powdery it is but overall, other than that, it's a great palette. Um, but if you want to receive items like this, uh, go ahead. I will leave a link in the description where you can check Ipsy out yourself. It is not an affiliate link. I am not sponsored by Ipsy or anything. I'm not sponsored by Beauty For Real, which is the brand of this palette. Um, the link for Ipsy will give me points if you sign up and the points can then be used for free products but other than that anybody uh, but other than that it's not an affiliate link and anybody who signs up for Ipsy will have that same referral link where if someone uses it to sign up you get points um, so yeah that is all for tonight's video I hope you all enjoyed it. Um, it would mean so much to me if you would go ahead and hit that like and subscribe button. It will help me grow my channel. Um, I do kind of random content on here. I've been doing some makeup content, some baking content. Uh, I just, I, I don't know. I don't know. It's just random and kind of chaotic, I guess you could say. But that's my life, so we'll see you next time. Bye.